We both got great educations at Kent that have served us well and served as a platform for me to go on to law school. And we both learned uh, and developed leadership skills. Carol probably already had them. I developed them uh, during my time at Kent. I was a first generation college graduate. So when I was at Kent, it was a very exciting time for me. Probably my fondest memory at Kent was that I met Doug. 23 years ago, I got a call from her inviting me to participate in a brand new thing that they were just starting up and getting involved in called the Children's Burn Foundation. I have received so much more out of what I've done than I feel that I've given. And so it has been a really heartwarming thing, but I think it's also been something that has given my life purpose. She's a hard act to follow. <laughs> uh, I mean, I, I would really echo what Carol said in the sense that uh, I too do things not because we're trying to climb up some social ladder or anything like that, but rather because it's kind of in our DNA. They're funny. They're adorable together. They're strong individuals who work perfectly as a team together and they accomplish amazing things. What's been very exciting for us is the ability to work together on these projects. I think we both have very different skill sets, but I, uh, hopefully they complement one another. But it's also wonderful to have a common goal. I know for a fact that both Carol and Doug have received many awards because they're active. To have your school nominate you for something that you've been doing for most of your lives in philanthropy, that, that's perfect. I think I want um, our legacy to be that we helped people and that we did whatever we could do. And I think we have both benefited by having tremendous mentors in our life and also benefited from the fact that we were able to get a wonderful education at Kent that broadened us and opened us to a lot of different experiences that we've had in our life.